Welcome back to another episode of Knowing Me, Knowing Blues. Today, Max Strick joins me on the sofa to answer your questions. Max, Hello. how thrilled are you to be here on the sofa today? Uh, absolutely delighted. You can't wait. Can't wait yeah, for your questions, can Yeah, can't wait can for you? your questions. I heard I've got the most questions out of every people, so... That's very I'll true. I'll be glad have. to answer them. Here we go then. Let's jump straight into it. So, first question is from Catherine. She said, hi, Max, you are the greatest goalkeeper we have had. Okay. Uh, is it very different at Wickham Wanderers compared to Livingston? And can you see yourself staying here for a few years? So, yes, I can see myself staying here for a few years. Second question was about Livingston. Yeah, compared to Wickham, what's it like? Uh, league One is much more competitive than Scottish Premier League. And then, obviously, that's why Wickham Wanderers, obviously, it's much better team. So you lived in Scotland. I have got a question for you because yeah. I got a bit of grief from Jack for never ha never having mm -hmm. iron brew before. Have you had iron brew before? I tried it, yeah. And what was the verdict? What do you think? Um, was alright. Was alright. Alright, oh, just, just alright. Oh, Let's just alright. So we're not missing but out. But to be there. fair, I don't really drink sparkling drinks. I just don't like them. So okay. that's why. But I'm not missing out like, on anything. No, no, it's no? fine. Okay. No, I think <laughs> Jack obviously will kill me, but like you can do better than this. <laughs> Uh, Jonathan said, Max has been fantastic for Wickham since joining. I hope he stays for a long time. What has improved most in your game in the last three years and what skill do you find most difficult and why? Game term, massively. Obviously for the last three years I played, I don't know, in total maybe like 150 games. Mm -hmm. So I think mentally I improved massively because obviously I'm more mature and I manage the game well and stuff like this. So. I presume managing the game is much better and maybe I'm not getting too emotional during the games, even though sometimes I do. <laughs> and the second question was about... What do you find, what skill do you find most difficult <sighs> and why? I'm a goat apparently, someone said it on Twitter, so... <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, yeah, probably playing out from the back, kicking and stuff like this. Yeah. But that comes from mentally side and obviously from the tactics we try to play and implement. And that's mm -hmm. really it. I mean, the fans are loving you, so I don't think you're really doing that much wrong, are you? Um, Johnny said, has your dog always been called Major? Or did he start out as a private and work his way up through the ranks? I thought about this question. He was always a boss, so... He's always a yeah, boss. Yeah, he straight away, you know, knowledge and everything. He's the boss. Major. Love that. That's such a good dog's name. Yeah, but actually, someone guessed it right. It's from military ranks. Basically. Oh, it is? Yeah. That's why you called him Major? Yeah, exactly. Because he was, he was a boss, basically. I had a dog. And, and also, Sam. when he was a little puppy, hmm. he obviously had like eight different brothers and sisters, and he seemed like he was, he was one the of, of the pack. Yeah, he was the leader of the pack. So Love we just that called him Major. Major. Very nice. Um, Suzanne said, which Wiccan player is the best at darts? Some folks. Some boats. Are you good at darts? Mm, average. Average. Maybe that could be the next mm. content. We'll have you versus Vokes, oh. game of darts. I'm not I'm not even trying to win against <laughs> him. That's the thing, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> not bothered, not fast. Nah. Um, Charlotte and Ella said, who do you think is the best footballer in the world and who is the best player that you've played with? The best footballer in the world? Messi or Ronaldo? Which one though? You've got a set mm. the debate now, Max. Uh -huh. Come on. <laughs> It's difficult because Ronaldo, he's walked his way through and Messi is just like talented. Mm -hmm. But at this moment in time, I take Messi. Messi, yeah. Messi's the best, you heard it here. And the second question was about the best player I ever played with. Yeah. Hmm, interesting one. <laughs> John O'Shea or Jeremy Defoe? Depends if we're talking about defensively or attacking wise. Probably Jeremy Defoe because you can score amazing goals. Jermaine Vaux, great. Uh, Samantha would like to know, if you weren't such a fabulous goalkeeper, mm -hmm. what would you be doing? Oh, wow. <sighs> Probably something with engineering, maybe like projects with gas projects, gas, gas pipes, stuff like this, because okay. my family live, like, work with gas yeah. back home. And uh, I would probably follow the pathway of of something engineering, even though I've got my law degree finished, so mm -hmm. maybe I go this way, or maybe a goalkeeper training sessions or something like that. I don't know. I never thought about it because obviously, 
Yeah, I just never thought about it really. I always knew I wanted to be a footballer. Yep, and you made it happen. Here you are. Exactly. Amazing. Glad. Phil would like to know if you were Wickham. I don't know. Is it you, Phil? No. Different Phil. <laughs> it's a different Phil. Okay. Phil would like to know if you were Wickham manager and were offered Harry Kane or Robert Lewandowski on a free, who would you choose? In a pick form or just now? I think I would probably say. Tricky question. I've got two passports, so I go off with Harry Kane. <laughs> You're going for Harry Kane. I didn't think you were going to say that actually. I no, Harry Kane scored more goals, to be fair, and yeah. I think he's actually like proper goal scorer. While Lewandowski, I think he's amazing striker, but for a national team, he doesn't really he doesn't really did enough for me. Okay, so Harry Kane it is. Yeah. Matt said, "Who, in your opinion, is the best goalkeeper of all time? And if you could sign one player that you've played with at a previous club, mm -hmm. then who would you bring to Adams Park?" So first one, who's the best goalkeeper of all time? Gianluigi Buffon. Mm -hmm. For me. Uh, second question was, I probably have to go with Jeremy Defoe or maybe Wes Brown this time. Wes Brown. Love Wes Brown. Good yeah. choice. Uh, George would like to know, what is your favourite Polish sausage? <sighs> what a question that is. What a stressful uh, question. Yeah, really. <laughs> yeah, I go for it's called hunter's sausage okay for this one tell us a bit about it it's just nice flavor and just you can a good yeah basically yes yeah. you can Lovely. add it to anything Amazing. you can fry it on a pan you can grill it you can do whatever you want do you have it for breakfast do you have it for dinner no Both? it's mainly like a mm, lunch time or like okay. dinner very nice stuff yeah okay it's time to pick a team dan has asked would you rather fight a bear-sized duck or 10 duck-sized bears? Both. I deal with major, don't remember that. <laughs> both, you're gonna take yeah, them all? Both. Yeah, take, take them, them all, all. love that. I'm not so you're on your own team anything. then at the moment? Yeah, Nobody said exactly. that before. <laughs> yes. Uh, the Wickham Way said, who was your goalkeeping idol growing up? I never had an idol, obviously. I think I looked in different goalkeepers and I tried to implement to my style of play. Mm -hmm. Every single bit which I thought was the best, then I try to implement that in my my style of play. So That's very smart. I looked in Casillas a lot. I looked at Buffon a lot. Mm -hmm. Oliver Kahn obviously was there because I'm quite old now. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Manuel Neuer and people like this. Yeah. Very good. I like that approach. Uh, Callum said, if you weren't a goalkeeper, what other position would you play in? Striker. Striker. Yeah. Yeah. Would you be scoring all the goals? Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> More than Harry Kane? Oh, that, nah, probably no. <laughs> uh, nothing But T said, if you could be in any movie, which one would it be? Apparently, I look like the actor from Jason Bourne, Matt Devon. So I go for this one. A little bit. Exactly. So you'd go for the Bourne, yeah. the Bourne films? Yeah. I quite enjoy those films, actually. They're good. Jason I feel like Bourne, yeah. Yeah. Um, Chris said, what fan base has been the easiest to wind up this season? I don't wind up with a fan base. You don't? No. Nah. Just ignore them, pretend they're not there? No. Nah. I wanted to, I, I <laughs> thought about it to be fair, I had one team, but I'm not going to name it because we got beat 4-0 from them. Okay. Day, so we'll keep that one up. You heard it then. as well. <laughs> yeah. Um, Andy has got, <laughs> Andy's got two parts to his question. The first question is, what's your favorite cheese? Pecorino Romano. Oh, lovely. And the second part of the question is, with Wickham having a traditionally large Polish community, has it made it easier for you to settle in the area? Not necessarily. I, I lived here for 10 years, so mm -hmm. I never had a problem to yeah. actually move away from Scotland. Or, like, I lived in Sunderland for seven years, so I'm, I'm used to it. You're really. used to it anyway. Yeah. Uh, Tom said, what do you find easier handling, catching or holding a shot, or close range reflex saves? Both. Both? No, I just don't know what to answer because obviously it depends on the situation really, you know what I mean? I yeah. think sometimes you might drop the easy shot and sometimes you might make amazing save from two yards out. So You just love I just love making goal. saves, yeah. yeah. There we go. Stevie said, apart from your dog, what is your next favourite breed of dog? <laughs> I love all the dogs to be fair. So um, I would probably say Oh my gosh, now I'm going to probably 
share it again. So uh, <laughs> when we didn't have a road valley, I was thinking about getting Akita Inu. Okay. Or Samoyed. Yeah. Also Husky was on the list. Yeah. My girlfriend wanted, like, she's got Yorkshire Terrier. So I was like, but they're too small. Yeah, they're very small. And then obviously we end up with Rottweiler. But I love all the dogs. All the dogs. Yeah. We don't fave dogs over here. We love them all. Exactly. Um, Adam said, what's your favourite Polish food? Uh, whatever my nan made me when <laughs> she, she was alive. Uh, dumplings, probably. Dumplings. Yeah. And what's the thing that you miss the most that you can't get in England? I can get anything I want, really, at this point. They're like, yeah. you know, it's not. It's twenty first century. You if you want get something, anything, get anything. You? Yeah. yeah. Um, Colin would like to know who's the boss, you or Major? My girlfriend. Oh. <laughs> Major. That was the correct answer. Yeah. The first one. <laughs> no, so Major's the boss. Yeah, between me and him, yes. He's yeah. the obviously he woke me up at six today. Oh, lovely. So thanks, Major. I don't need Alan. <laughs> Uh, Owen said, which kit do you prefer wearing, the purple or the yellow? Uh, yellow. Yellow. Why do you like the yellow? I just don't know. I think I play better games in yellow kit. I don't know why. Oh, maybe it's a little bit of superstition there. Maybe. Good games in the yellow kit. But to be fair, probably, if we look at it, I kept most clean sheets in purple, so... Oh. So maybe you should be wearing the purple more often. Yeah, I don't care. As long as we win, I don't care. <laughs> Just kid, we don't care. Exactly. Uh, James said, who chases more balls, Major or Josh Scoen? Josh Scoen, <laughs> I think. Obviously, we Major is actually quite good with the ball. Mm. And uh, yeah, but Josh Scoen, I have to give him a credit. There we go, Josh. It's all yours. Uh, and Nigel has asked, which club as a child did you dream of playing for and why? Wow. I never had my favourite team, that's the thing. You didn't? No. You I watched obviously team. No, I, I watched Chelsea when obviously okay. Mourinho was there. Mm -hmm. I watched like massive games like Man United games and even Real Madrid. I, I probably would say Real Madrid. Yeah? Yeah. Good team. Um, okay, we're up to the final question. This mm -hmm. isn't from one person in particular. Okay, the internet has been asking are you staying, Max, next season? The answer to this question is yes, because I've got a contract for another season and I'm looking forward to it. Amazing news. That's exactly what we wanted to hear. Max, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you. It's been a pleasure. You're welcome. Thanks for watching Knowing Me, Knowing Blues. <laughs>